um, I would choose Nigeria. Uh, definitely, I would go for Ghana. <laughs> we said it's still nice, and that people, I think they're hospitable, only that they're so talkative and personally, I wouldn't compete. I wouldn't want to compete. I wouldn't want to even associate with talkative people. The moment I find, I, we introduce ourselves, you know, my handle, my Instagram handle is Agraham Marion. The moment I meet and you are a Nigerian, I'll be like, bye, 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 dear. Yo, what's popping? I am the Kenyan beast. Uh, come with me. Let's roll the African way. So in today's video, sorry for this uh, intro. Uh, my subscribers, thank you so much for subscribing on my YouTube channel. Returning subscriber, this is the place. Thank you so much for loving me and I love you too. For the new subscribers, this is the place to be. So sorry for this intro, but the video, the today's video is about uh, Ghana and Nigeria and Uganda. Now, uh, Uganda's... Uh, is a video about what Ugandans prefer or which country hold you a Ugandan prefer between Ghana and Nigeria. So Ugandans gave away their you know their views about the topic and then they said why you know if you choose Ghana you say why you love Ghana. If you choose Nigeria you say why you love Nigeria. So in today's video is about Ghana and Nigeria Ugandans being you know the judges here. This video is not a uh, political, it's just opinionated video to see how uh, each uh, uh, people from uh, neighbor, uh, neighboring countries know uh, the other countries, you know, just learning here and there. Let's go into the video. I am the Kenyan beast. Come with me. Let's roll the African way. Uh, Marion Abraham from Kasese, Uganda. Uh, usually what I know about Ghana, I, I know the interesting story about them that they eat green grass on cassava. I don't know if it is real. I hear those people get that green grass, they pound it, then they make sauce out of it and cook and eat. I don't know if it is real. And then the other thing I know about Ghana, they are musicians. I know Fev. He's really beautiful. She's really beautiful. She's the most amazing lady I've seen on this world. I'm, I mean, the whole music country of Africa. And then Nigeria, Nigeria, all I know about them, they are so, 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 so talkative. And, they, and their English is a little bit different from ours, you know. And then also their music is giving, it's real bougie, it's giving their music very nice. And maybe the one I know there is Ariasta. She has very nice music. Personally, I'm a, I'm a person of said music, but Ariasta's music gives, really. Um, Another thing I know about Nigeria, I think it has many tourist attractions. Though I've not yet traveled Nigeria, I've not yet seen, but I follow it. I know, I know there, I know the whole country I've visited. It's still nice, and there are people, I think they're hospitable, only that they're so talkative, and personally, I wouldn't compete. I wouldn't want to compete. I wouldn't want to even associate with talkative people. The moment I find, I, we introduce ourselves, you know my handle, my Instagram handle is Agraham Marion. The moment I meet and you are a Nigerian, I'll be like, bye, 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 dear. I can't really, really associate with you. Yeah, that's all I know. I will choose Nigeria because I have dreams of seeing Ariasta. That's all. So I will choose Nigeria. Maybe by chance I would meet her. Yeah. My name is Abraham Marion. That's my Instagram handle, BMC Talk. All my other channels Abraham Marion. I even have a YouTube channel. Uh, thank you. I'm Tracy Hannah. I come from uh, Fort Porto City. I came around this side. Uh, definitely I would go for Ghana. <laughs> yeah, Ghanaian people are so nice, honestly. I, I, I like them, you know, they're entertaining. Yeah, unlike for Nigerians, they're a bit talkative. I wouldn't really compete with them. <laughs> but for Ghana, Ghana, I have Ghanaian friends there, so I'm really comfortable there. That's why. Uh, some people would choose Nigeria, which is okay, because, I mean, we all have our reasons. <laughs> the Ghanaian people are nice as well. At least that uh, they are friendly as well. Yeah, they're friendly. They are also, um, they are hospitable because I think they are beaches. The beach have been there, like, in town. Yeah, in, it is really okay the people there are also hospitable as well they entertain us the foreigners you know they are really loving and caring really so I would, I would, 
or what they have. Like I like their food. Their food is really nice. I've tried them in numerous restaurants. They are really nice, really. I can't deny that fact for sure. <laughs> yeah. Other people of Nigeria are nice. They're not bad people. But maybe, uh, I think their language, I think it may be a little harsh and rude. But if you understand a little, they are, they are really okay. I have no problem with them. They are really nice. <laughs> yeah, and then they are also, yeah, a little, a little, I think, talkative. You know, they want to talk all the time, so many words at the same time, you know. But they are really okay. They, they, they are nice. They are nice, yeah. What is about Ghana? Uh, for, for Ghana, you mean the... The people around falls and stuff, eh? But my experience with Nigeria, uh, the falls there, uh, only that they are strict, yeah, they are a little strict with everything around, but it's really nice, the place is nice as well, but not as this. This is really something big and I'm really happy, I'm excited, it's really beautiful. For Nigeria, yes, the, the place is okay, but the environment, the people, they're not hospitable enough, yeah, I like this side. This side, it is really nice. And for Nigeria, um, a little, the thing that is different with them, they ask for some, of course, uh, a huge amount of money to maybe go for the falls and stuff. But at least here, it is at least, at least uh, affordable. Anyone can pay. Uh, it is something really nice. It's really a nice experience to be on these falls, unlike the other side. But also Nigeria is also okay if some people want to go and you know, visit there. It's really a beautiful, beautiful place. I can encourage you to go there as well. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm Hannah Tracy. You can follow me on my Instagram page. I use TNL Hannah. And for more views and yeah, that is all. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, hello. My name is Atire Chowan from Uganda. Two five six. Um. Um, if given a chance to go to other countries, Ghana or Nigeria, um, I would choose Nigeria. Because Nigeria, they support, like, they support a young talent. They, they don't, they, I don't know my talent yet, but they support. They have, like, that, that heart, that big heart, unlike us. What I know about Nigeria, Nigeria, um, they have nice food, they have nice women, like, they have nice women and nice men. I like Omale. Uh, then Ghana, right? Ghana. Apart from their music, I like it that they are. They like them so. Should I say that? Tebesa Sola. Tebesa Sola. They support each other. Yeah. And what else? Ah, uh, I know, like, I know, like, I know small, like, small, small bits about Ghana. Um, I only like Jackie Appiah from Ghana. That's what I know from Ghana. I only like Jackie Appiah. And they are dressing code, by the way, I like their dressing code so, so very much. And they are, they are music. This thing like this, like this, like this. You know, they are music, like they are dances. Not they are music, but they are dances. They are culture dance. I like their culture dance. Uh, about theft, honestly, I truly don't go anywhere. But what I know about them, uh, when they have started juju, it's very serious. That's what I know about them. Yeah.